Good morning from Tbilisi, Georgia. Our van is arriving, it's 5.30 a.m. And this is the first ever hidden photo tour and it all starts right now. Let's go. Good morning. How you doing, man? Yeah, I'm coming with you in front, yeah. Okay. Got this? Thanks, man. Testing one, two, test, test, and good morning from Tbilisi, Georgia. This is our very first photo location, and it is a classic landscape. So we're trying to uh, do something very different with the hidden photo tours and uh, combine architecture, photography, and sort of urbex and uh, exploring with landscapes and kind of classic cultural travel photography. So our first location here is a beautiful postcard of Tbilisi city. We're a bit overcast, but it has stopped raining, which is huge. You guys know as photographers that it's nice to have some dramatic weather, but not get pissed down on. So here we are at this beautiful viewpoint and it's about 6 a.m. And this is a pretty good start to the trip. Yeah, I think it'll be okay too, but it'll be Tetris. I'm gonna try and keep my voice down because we are in a residential area here in Tbilisi and this is sort of the first kind of urbex shot and we've got this amazing old Cadillac here and it's an absolutely perfect wide angle photo and uh, there's only two of the group participants with me because what we've been able to do with this tour is actually split up the group and then within that split, split the group again so that there's only like maximum three people max at every uh, urbex location to allow you the space that you need to get the photo so it's a very uh, kind of uh, what, like fragile balance here in Tbilisi this is the most difficult sort of urbex situation uh, throughout this whole tour but I think we've done a pretty good idea done a good job at planning how to uh, organize the group so that everybody can get the photo in the locations that you're gonna see in this video and this first one is pretty awesome <music> One of our next urban locations here is a hallway and a very, very old staircase. You've got uh, two of the guys here behind me photographing the walls because there's a ton of detail in this, uh, this peeling paint, really, really old columns and, uh, and beautiful like concrete work it looks like, but it's really falling apart. And uh, there's incredible detail with the shadows coming through here. And you got really, really nice like red tones and, and like a dark blue as well that we'll be able to punch and post big time. So this is a uh, really good example. You got marble stairs here of sort of the opulence of what Tbilisi uh, used to have and now it's been sort of forgotten and, uh, and left to ruin and it is just hidden throughout the city and that's where uh, we come in to find these places and share them with uh, photographers who are looking to capture images like this and this is a, a pretty good one. So another cool location here in Tbilisi, Georgia. <music> Light just went off, we're at another location. This is possibly the best staircase that I've seen outside of Hamburg. It is uh, absolutely stunning residential uh, staircase building here. See the floor, the tiles are what really make this image for me. And then of course this beautiful staircase, the light coming through from the top. So we have got uh, three different images here and we split the group again into two and then again into uh, smaller groups. So we got two people on each spot uh, to be able to get the photos and not 
uh, bother the people who are living here. So that's really important. And we do have a local driver guide with us named Georgi, and he has been able to, uh, to help explain sort of what we're doing. And a lot of people have just been really, really nice and inviting. And, uh, and that's the, the best we could hope for really is that when we're in their residential building taking photos, they're totally okay with us being there as long as we're quiet and respectful. So yeah, amazing location here in Tbilisi. And we have made it to the Narikala Fortress. This is the uh, the main fortress overlooking Tbilisi and the river. It is the one that you saw on the left hand side of the view from the sunrise this morning. And it's a very, very good location for sunset. A couple days ago, I came up here to sort of re-scout it just to make sure that it would be a good location for the group and shot a pano and I was pretty happy with it. The light wasn't great, but we had some crazy cloud movement and I was able to get a really dynamic shot. So I figured this would be a good location for the whole group to come up so that we could come back together after being uh, split up for a lot of the day. And uh, here we are from sunrise to sunset. We made it to the top of the Narikala Fortress overlooking Tbilisi, Georgia, and this is a beautiful view. We've got some really, really nice light for our first sunset, which is uh, pretty lucky, to be honest. The weather's been kind of crazy all day, and uh, the clouds are uh, reflecting that, which, as you guys know, can often create uh, amazing dynamic scenes for photography. So we got pretty lucky with the sun kind of coming across the valley a couple different times. And this is also the end of our first video. So thank you as always for watching. It's been an awesome day exploring Tbilisi and you have got a lot to look forward to over the next couple of videos as we continue to explore Georgia on the first ever hidden photo tour. We are going next uh, almost to the border with Russia up in the north to a place called Stepensminda and uh, Mount Kazbek and a beautiful church on an incredible lookout. So lots to look forward to there. Get the drone up in the air and I think it's going to be a great video. So I'll see you in the next one.